Hi guys, um, my name is Hope, and I'm a staff member for the Harry Potter Alliance. And you might know me from doing like crazy videos. If you follow me, I do no new stuff. Woo! Um, and I did the WWDD video, but um, and you might know me as like crazy video girl. But right now, I'm just gonna sit down and I'm gonna have a very serious video for once. Um, as all of you in America knows, Thanksgiving is like so soon and it won't come fast enough because I want some good eatings because I'm a poor college kid as you can see from the dorm room. Anyway, um, <laughs> so I just wanted to share just some things that I'm very very grateful for. Um, of course there's my friends and my family because you know they're your friends, your family and they're the standard Thanksgiving answer but I wanted to talk about things that I was also like other things um, I probably should have wrote down a list. <laughs> I'm, I'm very grateful for this community. the The entire community of Harry Potter has has changed my life. It, it really has, and that sounds so. I don't want to say like sappy, but it's it's very true. Um, I was going through a very hard time a few years ago, um, and. It was about the time that I got into Wizard Rock, and I got really into the community, and I started uh, just loving it. Like, I liked it before, but then I loved it. It was it was a difference, you know? I, I sunk more into the whole, I guess the whole, like, the whole Wizard Rock s scene, and I just started meeting people. I, I met the wonderful, wonderful Matt Majacomo, who is one of my, my favorite people in, in the world. And just just from meeting him, he's like one of my dearest friends in this community. And through meeting him and following his videos, I found out more about the HPA, which got me involved with the Harry Potter Alliance, and now I'm a staff member. And being a part of the Harry Potter Alliance has changed my life, even though I've only been in it since, like, April. Yeah, April. Um... And everything I do, I'm just so proud of. And I'm actually, I'm really, really proud of my community. I'm proud of the people in it. I'm proud of my friends. And I can, I can wear my Harry Potter shirts and be proud of myself. Because I know I'm achieving something greater through my fandom. And even though I'm in other fandoms, like, like I'm in Lord of the Rings and Torchwood and, and Star Wars... I did not set these up on purpose, I promise. They were just on the wall. <laughs> I can't say that about any of them. I, I can't say, oh yeah, we have the Star Wars humanitarian group, or the Doctor Who humanitarian group. Yeah. I can't say that. So um, I'm, I'm very grateful for this fandom. And I'm, I'm very, very happy to have met the people that I have met in the last year. It's, it's, it's been a year that has pretty much... It has changed my life. It has given me plans for the future. I know I want to go north. I know I want to move to Rhode Island. Um, and Matt's been helping me get my ducks in a row for that. And I wouldn't have been able to make, um, be able to make a commitment like that if I didn't have the help of Matt Majacomo. I love you, Matt. <laughs> um, so I'm very, very grateful for this community. It has given me inspiration. Um, I, I've started rereading the books again. When every time I read Harry Potter, it makes me want to write. Um, it has given me life. It has given me meaning, um, and it just gives me something to look forward to. Like I look forward to things like Infinitus and Leaky Con 2011 and stuff like that. I, I, and rock stocks in the future. Rock stock. <laughs> I I look forward to these things, and it's kind. of... It's kind of exciting. I mean, it is exciting. It's not dying. Our, now that, like, even though the books are done and the movies are going to be done, um, we are book eight. We are. Like, it's the fans. And, I mean, what? Star Wars had, like, what, like, 30 years before the new movies came out and the new movies sucked so it didn't matter? I mean, and you still had the fans. And, and that's going to be us. I mean, we're going to be sharing it with our children. My mom shared Star Wars with me when I was a child. And... 
it's just going to keep going. And the way that we'll just keep our love alive is just loving each other. And that's what it all boils down to. So um, I'm challenging you all. I'm ch Let me try talking with words now. I'm challenging all of you to go out and, um, for those who you're grateful for, let them know. Um, it's called Magical Acts of Gratitude. And I want you all to go out to those people who really, really mean a lot to you. Um, whether it's friends or families or mentors, those Dumbledores in your life, WWDD, <laughs> yeah, see what I did there? Um, go out and just let them know. Either write them a letter or make them a card or knit them a scarf or, or make them a house tie or, or <laughs> make them like a finger puppet squid. This is, this is Huffle the second because I lost the first one. Um, <laughs> make them a finger puppet squid. Just, just something so they know that you love them and to thank them for being in your life. So, yeah, my name's Hope. Bye. Happy Thanksgiving to all you Americans and for those who are in America. Happy life. Happy life to all of you. <laughs> okay, I'll stop being a nerd. Um, the weapon we have is love, guys. Thank you so much for giving me life and thank you so much for being in my life even if I haven't met you yet I love you anyway because we're all in the same fandom together remember the weapon we have is love peace love and good karma guys <laughs>